A federal judge says a civil lawsuit against two officers accused of excessive force can go to trial. The case surrounds Jamarian Robinson, who was shot at least 59 times when a U.S. Marshal Task Force tried to arrest him in 2016. Robinson's mother filed a lawsuit last year, but a judge dismissed the case, saying the officers had immunity. But a federal appeals court now says that immunity did not extend to shooting an unconscious suspect. Video of the incident seemed to make a big difference in that decision. In the video, you hear a lot of gunfire, then a flashbang. Officers threw it to make sure Robinson was either unconscious or dead. Officer statements say that no shots were fired after that flashbang, but you can hear another round on the video. The judge ruled that U.S. Marshal Eric Hines and Detective Daniel Doyle could have fired their weapons after the flashbang. Only Hines can answer questions now about the day Doyle died in 2020. And the judge also ruled that there was no evidence Clayton County Police Officer Christopher Hutchins fired his weapon after the flashbang. Both Officer Hutchins and Inspector Hines have pleaded not guilty in the criminal case tied to the shooting.